Hello, I'm Kirill Kravets and in this video I want to share with you my Finkster experience. I got acquainted with Finkster more than one year ago and uh, since that time I interact with it almost every day. I used to work as a data analyst, which is more data presentation and reporting kind of job, and it involved almost no Python related tasks. Currently, I'm a full-time remote data engineer and I work on building a large-scale database which gathers and stores all available statistics in the world. Uh, how I did this transition? Uh, well, I spent half a year learning cloud solutions, Python and query languages. And I worked as a freelancer for a couple of months, which was a good competitive advantage during my application interview. I'm really grateful to Chris and his project Finkster, uh, because with his help I got my knowledge structured, I enriched it and I I learned how to focus on the right things in order to uh, make it time efficient, so to say. Um, in general, my dream lifestyle is so-called nomad lifestyle, well, when you can travel the world and have a constant source of income. I'm still working on it, uh, and Finster resources help me a lot, namely Finster application with Python quizzes. Uh, it's a good source of practicing your code understanding and uh, learning uh, how to code uh, any algorithm properly. Uh, Finkster Freelancer course, it's a good source of uh, freelance principles, working lifestyle and just a good uh, way to see how other freelancers work. Finkster ML course, uh, well actually there are plenty of them, by this time there are around 10 or 15. And there are very good introduction uh, with the key concepts of uh, different topics, uh, and and they also have related materials so that you can explore it on your own later on. Also, I find them pretty inspirational. That's for me. And there is also a Finster blog. Uh, this uh, this is a resource which I contributed to as well with the help of Chris, and it's a good place to read some tips and tricks and improve uh, general development skills, like the process, the agile, what's Agile, what's Scrum, and so on and so forth. Uh, I hope that was useful, and I encourage you to join the course. Materials are good, Chris is always there to help you, and in general it feels like a small community. I like that. And thank you very much, and have a good day. Bye.